Just visit the new calgaryherald.com with more of everything worth knowing. Paul Dillon is restocking his shelves. He's expecting a busy night as shoppers stock up before the new sin taxes take effect. Just a direct tax on Albertans. What can you do? Mike Schaffner heard about the tax increase on the radio and popped in to pick up a bottle. He says drinkers and smokers are safe targets for the government. Well, I guess it's one place that the, you're not going to get a lot of complaints from, I guess, because it's not exactly healthy. There will be increases in liquor markups and tobacco tax. In her budget, Finance Minister Iris Evans upped the taxes on cigarettes by three bucks a carton. Up to six dollars more tax on a cigar. Customers will fork over 285 more for a bottle of spirits, 75 cents more for a bottle of wine, while a 12 pack of beer goes up a dollar 30 in tax. Paul Dillon expects prices to rise even higher. By the time the consumers get their hands on their beer, there will be an increase of some around two to three bucks a case. So that's a pretty big jump. Well, they just keep whacking the poor old working man, eh? Last vice I got left, and that's all there is to say. The province expects to make an extra $180 million from its liquor markups and $70 million more from higher taxes on cigarettes and cigars. I know it's a sin tax, but uh, in these tough times, this, this will have a very drastic effect on the hospitality industry. Finance Minister Iris Evans says the Albertans will be out of deficit budgets by 2012, in part on the back of their vices. Rick Donkers, CalgaryHerald.com.